Hi guys, the Puppy News here, and today I am going to be teaching you how to make an origami tulip, like this one here. They are quite simple to make, and I definitely recommend them for beginners. All you need to make an origami tulip is a square piece of paper. You could use, you could get printer paper and cut it into a square, or you could use origami paper, or you could do what I'm using right now, which is craft paper, double-sided craft paper. Now, the first thing you have to do is fold it in half, lengthways. We're making a triangle base. Then rotate it 90 degrees horizontally and fold it in half again. Like so. Now flip the paper and fold it in half diagonally. Turn it around and do the same for the other corner. So you end up with something like this. Now, flip it over so that it lifts out from the table. Grab these two corners and push them to the center. So, like that. Pull this one down, pull this one down. You have your triangle base now. Grab one of this, the sides, and fold it up to the middle like that. Crease well. Do the same for the other side. Flip over and repeat the previous steps. Now, this is the crucial bit. It's a quite a small step, so many people overlook this step, and then their tulip ends up in failure. Grab this, this left side, and turn it over to the right, like you're reading a book. Flip it over, and do the same. Turn it around, and now, fold this to the center. That's like that. It's a bit fiddly, but it will get better with practice. Flip it over, fold it to the center. We're nearly done. Tuck the thing, the side one into the right, the left side thing into the right one. Then push it down flat. Now, I'm not sure if the camera will pick up on this, but there's a hole here in the middle there. There. Now blow onto it to inflate the tulip. Now it should look something like this. Now, curl down the petals to finish off your tulip. And there you have it, your tulip. You can add drops of essential oil, oils or perfume to fragrance. Um, to make these tulips fragrant or you can attach them to stems 
or you can just leave them around as a decoration to your house. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe. Bye!